main people's for us today is to recognize I mean, uh, the work that we are doing with South 32, in particular the collaboration, the cooperation and their resilience as well when we had adverse situations that uh, we faced. And uh, we are really, really, I mean, uh, 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 recognizing that in particular, I mean, uh, the management and the people, I mean, who are behind all the work that has been done in here. We have gone through very rough times whereby most of the news have been negative. So this is one of our initiatives to try to bring a positive messages and to drive that narrative uh, throughout the organization to recognize where there's improvements and to, uh, with, the, with, the, who, uh, with the intention of uh, making sure that uh, we will motivate, I mean, uh, the employees who will uh, motivate each other as well to make sure that we can achieve even further greater issues in the name of cooperation, collaboration, and uh, and uh, and making sure that I mean uh, we are working more closely to deal with the challenges and uh, the problems that we face on day-to-day -day basis in a very objective and uh, progressive, improving manner in terms of how we do things. Uh, today we're excited that we receive a recognition from our local. Uh, port authority. This, uh, this recognition is uh, to recognize the efforts that we've put in, uh, in, in our operations at the port. Uh, Some time back we started having issues with, uh, with the ports where we lost a lot of uh, uh, opportunity in terms of uh, getting our, our product through the port. We got to a stage where the Alisa was not performing. We got to a stage where even our, our uh, export uh, uh, material was not going well. We, work, we started collaborating with the port, uh, the TNPA, we worked very close with the executive team of the port to come up with ways how we can resolve that. They, they lucky that we were given an opportunity as a stepping arrangement where we took over the maintenance of the ALISA and also we were also given an opportunity to bring private holders to assist us on the export front of the, of the operations of the port. Through those initiatives, we were able to improve the performance significantly. There were some stage in the past where we were run, we run at very low stock levels in our raw materials. At one stage when we had the port uh, fire, uh, conveyor fire incident, we actually dropped our aluminum stock to almost one day. So through these initi initiatives and the collaboration with the port, we were able to improve the performance of, of our port operations. We are now with the Ali, so we've actually improved the performance from about uh, 200 tons per hour to over 500 tons per hour, which enables us to turn the alumina vessels much faster. We are able to improve the or loading of what you call metal onto the vessels to the port so that we are able to get our export product much faster. So through this collaboration, we have seen some good results. We are going to continue working very close to the port to ensure that we maintain this performance because if we don't, this has got a significant impact in, in the operations of hillsides and also our profitability.